welcome back to my youtube channel so i'm going to be doing a little styling video i'm so excited because i feel like i've been doing these vlogs i've been showing you on tiktok like things that i've been finding when i've been going to the charity shops and then i haven't actually done many like styling videos this is like a new little outfit that i've got going on i'm not too sure on the hat I feel like I look a bit silly in it. Does it look silly? I don't know. But anyway, obviously I do these videos because I like to show you how I style things rather than showing you like new in pieces. I think it's just better. I think it's so much cooler to like shop secondhand and then challenge yourself to style it with pieces that you already have in your wardrobe. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll get on with the first outfit. So I thought I'd quickly run you through the outfit. Um, the blazer is obviously thrifted. I just want to say, like, if you go to a charity shop and you're looking for blazers, I'm pretty sure this cost me, like, £4, 3 or £4. With blazers, some of them, you can look at them and you can think, I don't know how I'm going to style that. Like, I don't know if it's going to look good on. I would wear a white shirt to the charity shop so that you can try it on and see how it looks and fits over, like, a white shirt. If this is kind of, like, a look that you might go for. Because there's literally no point in buying, like, a blazer from like pretty little thing or misguided for like 30 or 40 pound because the quality isn't as good you're literally spending what like five times the price when you can get a good quality blazer for like three or four pounds from a charity shop so yeah the shirt is also thrifted i think and then the jeans are misguided that i bought probably like a year or so ago maybe even like two years my hair is literally falling out oh yeah the hat is um the hat is asos as well i'm really kind of going for a bit more of like minimalistic but stylish look so this outfit is probably one of my favorite outfits i've ever put together so i've got this blazer which i got in a charity shop it's so cute for two pounds i love that it's cropped it's just like a bit different to like my usual blazers we've then got this shirt underneath so a lot of layering going on we're coming into autumn winter now so we can we can layer up with our shirts and our jumpers. I'm so excited. This dress is from ASOS. I have worn it on its own as well. It's quite plain, so I can literally just style it however I like. I love it. The tie is from ASOS. You can buy these from charity shops or secondhand. I've got a few actually from charity shops, but um, I really love this one. I thought it was really cool. The bag is from ASOS. My friends bought me this for my birthday. I love it so much and the hat is asos i think last year i haven't even spoken about these loafers like these loafers are from zara and i'll get them off and i'll show you them because they're really cute so i was after loafers for so long and i remember putting on my story like last year being like i can't remember what i said i said like should i get loafers or something like that and now everyone has loafers like i feel like everyone on tiktok and instagram has loafers but they are really cute and i do think they are a staple so i thought i would buy these ones from zara they were about 50 pounds as well you can wear them to work so that is why i did buy them because i was like you know what these will be perfect for work i can style them up with skirts knee high socks tights so this outfit you might have already seen on my vlog from when i went to london with sorrel um it's this really cute trench coat that i actually thrifted for I think it was $7.99 or $8.99, I can't remember. I'm literally obsessed with it. It comes with like the tie as well. It's got this really cute like detail on here, the buckle detail. It's got this detail going along there. I love the back as well. I think it's really cool. It's literally like my perfect trench coat and I found it in a charity shop. I'm just, oh, I don't even know. I've been wanting one for so long. I literally said to my friends, if I can find one in a charity shop, instead of having to buy one off like ASOS or somewhere because they're actually like quite expensive, like 60 pounds. So I'll talk through the outfit. Basically the shirt, I think I've already said, I'm pretty sure it's thrifted. This is thrifted, this waistcoat. I actually used to buy these waistcoats from charity shops years ago. Jeans are old misguided, I'm pretty sure like last year, something like that. And then the hat, I actually don't know, but I'm pretty sure you can buy these hats from ASOS because that's where I got my other one. I do also have my North Face bag. Honestly, I wasn't going to get this bag, but I'm so glad I did. It was £20. I think I got it in the sale. I'm pretty sure there was 20% off at ASOS. Years ago, I used to love layering shirts with like waistcoats, blazers, and I feel like I'm getting back into doing it now and I'm so excited. I feel like this autumn winter is going to be good. Like outfit wise, it's going to be good. So this outfit is a bit more casual for me, I guess you could say. I love this denim 
jacket now i've been after a denim jacket for so long sorry if i feel like i'm a bit like low down and i wasn't sure if i wanted like a long sleeve or a short sleeve kind of looking for both and then i went to h&m and i saw this one and i was like wow that is exactly what i'm looking for also excuse the hat like my hair is an absolute mess and i can't even be bothered like i've tried so many different hairstyles with this outfit it doesn't go and i don't even know if this hat goes but i just need to hide my hair it just doesn't look good so if you don't like the hat like i completely understand and i thought you know what let's do like a double denim moment because i really wanted some like denim shorts but I'm yet to find like denim shorts that actually look good on me. I just don't really think I suit shorts. I don't know if it's because I've got really long legs. So I bought this denim skirt in a charity shop for four pounds ages ago. And I'm just obsessed. Like I think it works really well together. So I've paired it with this bag, which my friends got me. I think it's from ASOS and they bought me this for my birthday. So cute. I literally love it. And it goes really well with the boots. I thought I put on my chunky boots. I don't know if like in this weather, I might need to put on a jumper underneath this denim. I feel like it's a bit plain for me, but I'm trying to go more like stylish, a bit more classic with what I'm wearing. And I know that like a sleeveless, denim jacket i've been wearing sleeveless jackets for years i know that it's not going to go out of style it is one of those pieces that is a classic for autumn winter so woohoo so i bought this puffer coat in a charity shop for 25 pounds i don't know if basically i put it on tiktok and a lot of people commented saying that it wasn't real so i actually don't know like when i was there i genuinely thought it was real so the woman at the till said that it was real so i just assumed that it was real like i don't know i didn't really question it because the woman said that other north face coats had actually come into the charity shop and they um she was under the impression that it was real basically and apparently they like went really quickly so she just said oh you're really lucky to like get it so I don't know, like how do you tell if it's real or not? I actually don't know. I'm gonna look into it. It doesn't really matter if I'm completely honest because at the end of the day, like I like the design. I think it looks really cool. So to me, like it's not like I'm gonna sell it on or anything like that. Like some people commented about how if you sold it on, you could make a profit. But to be honest, I'm not interested in doing that. I do genuinely want to wear it. And I know that my sister has been after a North Face jacket for so long. So I might actually send it um, up to her so that she can have it. So yeah, I'm really happy with it. I think it actually looks really cool. And I think this with like, just like a plain t-shirt or like a jumper underneath, low rise jeans. You can even do high waist jeans, keeping it relatively plain and simple maybe like a matching jogger set underneath that would look really cool so that is the end of the video hope you guys enjoyed this little video of me styling up some of my favorite pieces so yeah if you want to follow me on tiktok i'm a lot more like active on there nowadays i'll leave all the links and stuff in my bio if you want to go and check out my other social platforms i'm really trying to get into um doing like shorts and reels and TikToks, there is so much content to be done. Like honestly, even on YouTube, they've now got shorts. It's just so much content to be producing, but I enjoy it, I enjoy the challenge. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you all in my next video, bye.